An antique store has a collection of eight clocks. At a particular moment, the display times on seven of the eight clocks are 155, 203, 211, 224, 245, 319, 414. If the display times of all eight clocks form a mathematical series, this is very interesting. It's not a geometric progression, it's not an arithmetic progression, it's a mathematical series. I don't even know what it means. It's a lovely question. So let's do that. The mathematical series, one number is missing. It could be anywhere. It could be first, it could be right at the end, it could be anywhere in between. Any of these questions find differences. This difference is eight minutes. This difference is eight minutes. This difference is 13. This is 21. 10 plus 19. Oh, I know the sequence. I know the sequence. You guys should know the sequence as well. This is 55. This is a fabulous, fabulous, fabulous sequence. This sequence is called as the Fibonacci series. In fact, the, the primary Fibonacci series. 8 plus 13 is 21. 13 plus 21 is 34. 21 plus 34 is 55. The two numbers before this should add up to 8. Which have been 3 plus 5 is 8, 5 plus 8 is 13, and so on. We are looking at a time of 158. That's the one bang in the middle. The Fibonacci series, is the usual Fibonacci series starts with 1, 1, 2, 3, 5, 8, 13, 21, 34, 55, and so on. But it's naturally occurring in many things. The number of petals in a flower go by this sequence. Uh, the general ratio of uh, terms in a Fibonacci series is called as the golden ratio. It's a fabulous ratio. It's root 5 plus or minus 1 by 2, uh, reciprocal of the other. Um, it's something wonderful to think about and, and figure out. So do read up on golden ratio and where it naturally occurs. In the